to another DSF Watches Lost 2. This episode was called, I don't know what it was called. What was it called? Ab Eterno? Nothing stuck out in my mind. I liked when Jack was all... Wait a second. Locke? Locke's, Locke's dead. <laughs> he had no clue what was going on, and you kind of forget that, like, who's in the dark on what. Hurley to Jack on the beach when Jack thinks that Hurley's talking to Jacob he's trying to figure out what's going on mm -hmm. and Hurley's like you know trying to brush him off and I liked when he said this doesn't concern you because I love seeing Jack get stuffed especially by Hurley <laughs> yeah Hurley's by anyone definitely... Hurley that's a good thing too yeah Jacob hands the bottle of wine to uh, Smon Loxer and says this will help you pass the time and then he breaks it and says you know you'll see me sooner than you think and it just kind of makes me like question their concept of time because Smon Loxer says sooner and I guess a hundred years to them probably is sooner so it's pretty crazy to think and think of it in those terms. We didn't get any name for Smon Loxter. It really felt like it was coming at that conversation at the end there but Jacob just called him my friend a bunch. I was a little disappointed we didn't get to see anything about the lighthouse when the boat was coming. Mm. Or when Jacob was talking about how he brought the boat to the island. I kind of thought we were okay. going to get to see the lighthouse in action. It was kind of surprising to see the black rock broke the statue. I'm, and already uh, the internet is pretty finding it questionable that a wooden ship broke a stone statue. But maybe that thing was hollow. <laughs> okay. All right. So mine is the exact same thing. But here's what I'm going to say about that. Not only do I not believe that the ship would have broken the statue. Yeah. If it had, though, and I could see if they said, like, it was some crazy super wave or something, like tidal wave that, yeah. that hit the island. But if that was the case, nothing around the statue would be there. No trees, nothing. I mean, there were trees that were... You'd have uprooted trees all over the place. Uh, not to mention the fact that the black rock is left, like, pretty much intact. Exactly! That thing would, like, what go the hell? to shreds. I mean, that, that might prove to be the biggest continuity error. When Jacob gave the bottle of wine to Man in Black, and he held it upside down, corked and everything, and then smashed it, I think that was a good parallel for their... Uh, chaos versus order relationship on the island and how he's going to try to plan or how he's going to try to you know execute his plan to do whatever he wants to get off the island or whatever okay Jacob thinks he's gonna have to you know go by the rules but man in black's gonna try to go around that smash the bottle do everything in his power to get out okay screw the cork you know what I'm saying <laughs> interesting the island as the cork for all of everything that is evil and malevolent, which Smon Lockster embodies, apparently, according to Jacob. No. At first, yes. When they were talking about hell, but then no. <laughs> I wanted to see Vincent. No big surprises there. I knew it was a Richard episode. Maybe Vincent was his dog. You know, I don't know. Is Isabella's dog? You know. So mine was that Smon Lockster made Dick Alpert the Highlander. I was thinking maybe there was gonna be some major twist, and we we're gonna find out that both Jacob and the Man in Black can bestow immortality upon someone. Thanks for watching. Next week's All episode of you, or no, forty nine. We appreciate it. Leave some comments. If you've watched this far, you must leave a comment. Leave a comment. Come on, right please. Right here. Please. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Below. No, uh... Be first. Here we go. It's important to be first commenter, honestly. So go ahead and comment. I was, you know, getting nervous. When yeah, talking. same here. I was like, ah, oh, really? Don't tell me this is where we're headed, because... Really? Someone, I'm sure, nailed that on day one. I want to live forever. Me and my dog. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha